Hey guys, I'm finally I'm finally able to do a your your Masu review part two. So you may be wondering. Okay, it's been twenty days. Twenty days. Yeah, but I'm on to it. After the so tomorrow, non spoiler review coming up. So the T the T Rex that we left off at is is named Baku. He is the main villain of this, by the way, kinda. I think. I think Hart is basically traumatized right now. Okay, so here's this guy. He got um he got stabbed and by the way, I I actually think that this guy is a a character that I actually think that this guy um, grew up to be a character who we see later on in the story. So Baku, Baku is the is the leader of the of these this pack of big jaws. This T Rex named Gonza ends up noticing Heart and proceeds to. Stop the stop the the baby T Rex and and his path. The others of the pack come. The others of the pack come to check Hart out. Baku comes. To, Baku comes to the situation. Baku's actually rather friendly for um for late for the leader of a pack of you know bee eaters. So, okay, here here's the part that that kind of annoys me a little. Like, okay, the mom thing is good, but light? How is he gonna know who light is? <laughs> so Baku tells Hart to to go back to his mother and the other and the T Rexes of his pack to to leave him alone. <laughs> But before Hart can leave, Baku asks what his name is. And the response that Hart gives it makes has a thousand signs of him being a tsundere. I, mis I, mi I mispronounced it tsundere, right? Yeah, that joke was terrible. So Hart realize Hart realizes that those are big jaws and cries about it. So Hart right now is thinking that Light has been eaten by those big jaws, but uh, that's not the truth. So said said crying ends up making Hart drown. So uh uh yeah. But light ends up saving him. Good brother. So right as light is is comforting heart, a T Rex shows up. It's Gonza. And um, yeah, since light's here, I'm pretty sure he's getting pretty hungry, and we all gotta appreciate. <laughs> so after 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 and kicking him, the Gonzo pins light and bends light down and uh. Eh, 
that joke's a mess. So hearts attempt the uh, hearts attempt to to save got to save light from God's fails and uh Ah, this happens. This is awkward. Okay, okay, that must hurt. Okay, oh, okay. So yeah, heart bites Hans's tail, Gonza's tail until eventually, eventually, and uh, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. K.O. 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 Let's have a moment of silence for Gonza's tail. So, Hart ends up ingesting the severed tail, and, um... Kinda almost, oh my god! I'm disgusted, I am revolted, I dedicate my entire life to our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ! So, Hart runs away in fear of eating his own family, and that's actually kinda hard to deal with. It's not like I've had that fear before. <laughs> so we skip back to we skip back we skip all the way to um the first time I watched this movie I thought I thought that it was twenty years later, but I don't really know how old that any how old any of the characters are in this entire movie, so um yeah. So, so there's a, so we see Brachio, a bunch of Brachiosaur, Brachiosauruses protecting from an, from a, from an, from an unseen prayer. And the, the, the predator happens to be Hart. I mean the hunter. Are you, are you thinking the wrong thing? So Hart's strategy is to is to run through the the giant circle of brachiosauruses or whatever sauropods these are, and then and tire them out. Yeah. If this was real life, he'd probably get crushed. Hart's plan works, and all and all of the adult sauropods. Are, have now collapsed out of out of, out of exhaustion, except for the except for the older leader. So because of the because of the leader's not exhausted nap stuff or death, I don't know. Um, heart heart decides decides to take matters for himself. Wait a second. So, basically, it's a giant, it's a dinosaur who stands upright like a human, has spikes on his back, and knows martial arts, especially, and, and he's also capable of doing a, of doing a, um, a, a kick, a, a jump kick or drop kick that is that would be in, impossible to do in real life. Huh. This sounds really familiar. I just can't place my uh, place my place my finger on what it is. Uh, I guess it's just deja vu. So heart heart lands the hit and um, then. He dies. So Hart takes some meat before running away from the from the the now aged the the now the older T Rexes, including Gonza. Hart strays straight up insults Gonza about about the tail injury that he caused, and uh, understandably. 
Gonza gets super triggered. Okay, so I hope you I hope you enjoyed this the second the long awaited second part of the UR Masu review. And I hope I won't take as long to do the third part. Anyways, Sayonara. Wait, why are they do Sayonara.